putting our goals on paper and following through with them. This life is a mind game. It's all up in our heads. It's all how we think, like I've said before. Um, it's so crucial that we stick to um, our goals and the things that we want to achieve in life. And it's so crucial that we try to stay away from negative people and negative places. Um, if there's someone in your life that affects you negatively and is bringing you down and stopping you from your dreams, you know, get away from them. You know what I mean? Don't ever let anybody tell you you can't accomplish something in life. All you have to do is put your, your mind to it and work hard and it will happen. Um, it's all about how we perceive reality and how we look at ourselves in the world. Um, success is, you know, it, it first comes as being content in our own skin and being able to accept life, life on life's terms, not feeling uh, insecure all the time. Or staying out of our heads is huge. Um, I know it's easier said than done, but it is so big to try to stay out of our own heads. To try to stay out of yesterday and the day before. Try to stay out of uh, negative thinking patterns is huge. Practicing mindfulness is all about practicing positive thinking. And it's about projecting positive thoughts and thinking and vibrations into the universe, meaning around people and places and things. Like when you walk into a store, practicing putting a smile on your face, being friendly, saying hi, thank you. This stuff all helps us be mindful and more happy in life. When we concentrate on negative events that happen in our lives, it sets us back in life. And it puts us in negative thinking patterns, which leads us to moods and depression. Um, it's so easy to be caught up in our own heads with our own stuff going on in our lives. And it's so much easier to to pass on conflict. Conflict is the biggest thing that holds people back in life and not feeling worthy enough. We all have special gifts and talents, but a lot of people's special gifts and talents go to, um, unfortunately don't get used in life because they never figure out how to get out of their own heads. Because our own heads and our own minds is the only thing that's stopping us and standing in our ways in life. Um, staying up in my head thinking negatively for years held me back for years until now. Um, the moment you say to yourself, I'm going to do something, I wanna, I'm going to be successful, is powerful. And all you have to do is stick to it and get yourself a routine going, you know. Get a routine going of... Making sure you, you know, wake up uh, at a good time if you're not working yet. And, uh, you know, um, staying uh, mindful of people and uh, trying to stay away from negative people. Um, say if you have friends in your life and stuff, they're struggling. It's okay to help them and stuff. But if they're not willing to help themselves, then it's sometimes you get to step back. Especially if you're going through a hard time yourself in life. And... You need to work on yourself, you know? There's so many people lost out there, stuck up in their head, and I used to be just like that. Um, it's about projecting happiness and mental stability. We're stronger than we think we are. Um, a lot of us uh, grow up thinking uh, that we're not good enough and that, you know, we never will be and that we'll just have mediocre lives. Um, all that stuff's a lie. The truth is we can all do very uh, fantastic things with our lives and reach you know, monumental goals that we set for ourselves. Um, the elite, the, the successful people in this world know this trick and know how to think mindful. Meditation and thinking mindful goes a long ways. I have to meditate every day Every day I try to meditate. I, I, medit I meditate. I have to take time out for myself to be more conscious and present in the moment. Because people in my life and events can, 
can sometimes get me in a wrong, you know, pattern of uh, thinking. And, uh, you know, and I have to bring myself back down to earth and be centered with myself and my mind. Um, inhaling and taking deep breaths, like, like this. is part of meditation. Being able to stare, pick out an object, if you're looking at your, uh, uh, even staring at the wall or the ceiling, I mean, the, or the uh, your uh, phone or your, you know, uh, you know, screen on your computer. Being able to do that and sit up straight, feel everything around you, feel the environment, right? Feel the breeze, hear the birds, but set your mind to relaxation, not worrying about people, places, and things. Let your mind relax. Be at one with the universe and let your mind relax. Let your mind frequencies calm down. Don't think about stuff, especially negative stuff. When we when meditation is all about being aware of our surroundings, being conscious in the moment, present physically and mentally, being able to let go of any things that are bothering you at that time, and being able to take some deep breaths and stay awareness, mind awareness of what uh, is going on, and just paying attention to the breeze, the smell in the air, the birds chirping, um, just noises around you, and shut off yourself to the rest of the world. That's what meditation is all about. It's not like you have to sit in the Indian style or anything. You can do it, um, you can meditate in your car and in the parking lot. Um, there's a lot of good meditation music out there too. Um, I never was into med thinking that I was ever going to meditate years ago. I thought it was, you know, a little too much for me. Uh, but when I tried it, it was unbelievable. Um, you get a natural high from it. And you can manifest happiness through your mind by feeling the power of the universe and yourself being at one with the universe. Um, everyone has the uh, choice and the uh, ability to be able to meditate and to be able to be more aware of your thoughts. When we think negative, um, all the wonderful possibilities out there crumble. Um, when we think positive and we go around being uh, positive and with a smile on our face and compassionate, positive vibrations, we attract better things into our lives. Like people and places, good jobs, love of our lives. Um, people pick up on good good vibrations. It's like they do bad, bad vibration frequencies. Um, if you're able to start manifesting mindfulness, happiness, fake it till you make it, um, and start to be great or grateful about things. For me, for instance, I'm, great, I'm grateful for my clothes, say my watch, my shoes, my sneakers, my car, uh, family, friends, you know, being alive. So that stuff is very important in this life. And for those of you who are stuck in your head, um, the quickest, easiest way to get unstuck is, to be honest with you, is to get active. Get active. Set out a, you know, plan for yourself. Get in a routine. And it's very important, too, to not do the same thing day after day. Change things up. Be spontaneous. Um, because when we do the same thing day after day, our lives become predictable and nothing's going to change. Just remember, you all have it in you to change and to be happy. Everyone deserves happiness. And everyone deserves success. But before success and riches comes feeling comfortable in our own skin. And you, what you should, what I recommend is you practice in mindfulness, practicing uh, dropping negative thoughts from your mind, um, and practicing not um, retaliating against others with anger because they did something wrong to you, or when people send you a nasty text. 
Feel the power of not sending back a negative text. That is very powerful. Okay, that's what I do now. I ignore the negative world. Um, we all have family and stuff and friends. Uh, it's more harder with family. But I'm not saying block family all completely. But if someone's being negative and you, you know, especially trying to work on yourself, get your life together. Um, concentrate on uh, staying positive and thinking positive, staying away from negative people and negative thinking and drama. Drama is huge. Gossiping about other people brings us down too. It takes more weight, more energy away from us than anything and our goals in life. Um, so uh, I hope everyone has a great day. Um, remember, uh, happiness and success is there for you to get. Um, all you have to do is apply your mind to it and uh project happiness and try meditate try meditation and um please subscribe really appreciate if you could subscribe appreciate that and um i'm gonna keep doing these videos um hope everyone's doing well have any problems uh or any questions please write to me and like i said before i'm willing to do free video on one-on-one -on -one to help you get through and to help you Start with uh, if you need uh, any tips when it comes to meditation and getting out of your own mind. Because I've helped many people with this and I'm willing to help you too. Thank you. Uh, have a good day, everyone.